Hello and welcome everyone, I'm Aaron the Black Dragon and welcome back to more Pokemon Colosseum where in the last episode we got a little bit lost. And this time I actually know what to do and where to go. Because I had a right inclination last time that we had to talk to Silver. But the thing is, we cannot talk to Silver on any side other than up here. Which is weird and dumb. Because it's further away from Silver, you would think you have to be close to Silver to talk to him, but no, it's around the middle area that Silver actually reacts to you. Thanks! Sim, it's me, Silver, from Duncan's. I discovered that they were bringing Shadow Pokemon to Pirate from here. That's as far as I got when they caught me like this. But I did manage to flitch this from them. Here you go, what the heck is fi Filch? Oh. Phil, what is Filch? I think it's an item that's useful only down here in the under. Sure. So now we can actually move forward in the story, but in trying to figure out what to do, I also figured out that we are under leveled for what's to come. So it's in my best interest to go and train up the party now. And the question is where can we go for that? So we're gonna just try and run around a little bit. I mean it we can't go through this building again and have some fights against everyone since she is so hellbound on battling me every time. I'm gonna get out there, so she probably is a good way. Also, her Pokemon have level 38 at this point, so it should be a good enough way to train up my team. But you have ground type Pokemon, so I'm a little bit in a bad spot actually with what I have out there ready. Uh, Tony, you dig Muppet? I'm gonna switch you out for Squiggly. That should be fine. Now, if they were attacking Muppet, which would make sense for them, then Squiggly's gonna get hit a lot. Let's see, Sand Tomb. You attack Tony, you idiot! You attack Tony, you idiot! Why are they attacking Tony? Anyway, Surf. Okay, and you're gonna get hit now. That's the only downside to everything. And you don't deal a lot of damage with that. Oh boy, that's gonna sting. Yeah, okay, it's not as bad. But now I'm trapped inside the sand tomb. Let's just hope that that is enough to take out the Fampy. Yeah, damn it. Take down. Yikes. Yeah, that stings, and you did not take yourself out. Hurt by the sand tomb. Um, I'm gonna dig again and use surf. That way I can escape from one attack. And I get at least the XP for taking out Bambi, because I'm pretty sure I'm not strong enough. Unless I get a crit now, then yeah, that would be enough. And no crit. No level up there. Such as... I'm still hurt by it. It's interesting. Ah, let's risk it. Dig. Won't hit because levitate. Gust. Gust. Oh! Hang in there, Tony. That surf has to hit. Oh boy. Good. No level up, Tony. Oh boy. This didn't. It happened so many times by now. Accept it. Yeah, doesn't matter what you say. I'm gonna go through this whole area again. Yeah, you're gonna have to battle me as well. We're just gonna fight through all of them again because they're gonna train me up and then we're gonna try and figure out where else I can train my Pokemon. Level 40. So, I really would love for Tony to get some levels out of that. Because having a tough lotion would be nice, but Tony is about to die. Um, Hilbert, you go out there. 
I have confidence in you. Muppet, you shock the Noctowl, please. Because that could potentially put me to sleep and I hate that. And you use fly. With both of them! You are a prick! Uh, faint and thunder. Shock. Yeah, Hilbert does not care. Hilbert has a lot of defense. And he really should have attacked someone else than just Hilbert. I mean, okay, you were honed into uh, attacking Tony, but still. Wow, that did Jack Diddley. For being super effective, that did nothing. That's gonna hurt. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh, I hate that not down so much. Anyway, bye, Taylo. You know, my. I'm not sure if it's my team in general or just my specific two Pokemon there, but damn it! I'm a little bit weak. Yeah, but you attack like that. You're gonna get switched out for Dirk. Like for crying out loud. And then the fact that they don't get as much EXP actually. I wonder something right now. Because wasn't there like a little bit of an EXP share? Why is that thing? Why is that stupid bird so sturdy? Ah! But isn't there like a thing with the XP share that would help you gain? Can you stop with that, please? That's so obnoxious! Ah! Uh. I hate that bird. But yeah, isn't there something with the XP share where I can give one Pokemon more XP when it carries it, even if it's in battle? If you start flying up again, I'm gonna murder you. I'm just kidding. I'm gonna murder you regardless of that. Oh boy! Such a dumb prick! Well, at least nobody on my po team went down. <sighs> Shut up, Pike! So done with you! Yeah, I must level up my team. Let's try that actually, because I feel like there was something to that, right? The silk scarf. I don't think I have anyone that would benefit from that, so let's give that one to... I wanna have Tony level up, because Tony is uh, not as strong as he could be right now. Oh boy. But that was exhausting and annoying already. Make space, Yilda. We're gonna have to fight through all of them again. Boy, the ho! Ah! Uh. And they all have like dumbest Pokemon for me to train up, Muppet and Tony, which is really annoying. Wait, no, Tony, you dig. And I'm 100% sure Pubita had still the ground type, so Muppet, you're pointless in this fight yet again. Uh, Dirk, you got there. Ah, the frustration of this. And I know that I need a round level 42 to 43 to 
seven. Tony's dead. And there's no way to ever get Tony back because he died underground. I hate. I hate. Ah. I forgot how stupidly annoying this game was at certain points. Especially at this point where you are under leveled if you just follow the normal linear things that you need to do. Ah! Thresh, why didn't you use magnitude again? Oh. I'm so done. I'm so done right now. I can't tell you how done I am right now. At least you get some EXP. That's good. Uh, of course now Muppet would be good. I'm still gonna surf Psy Fudge! Swift. And that's the dark type. I've been as upset about the Pokemon fight as in a long time like I am right now. Oh no, you screeched at me. If I wanna have my defense better back, I use amnesia. Ugh. That's not gonna do a lot. That still did more than I thought. Bye, Pupita. I am so done with everything. So done. And I've only just begun. Ah. And with that fight, I actually did not train up any of the two Pokemon that I wanted to train up. That I only left 34 of 33. Shut up. You don't want to go anywhere. You want to sit yourself down and shut your trap. Boy! This is dumb. This is surprisingly dumb. I honestly do did not remember this arseness at this point. That's something I 100% forgot about. That's one easy one to take out. That's also easy enough to take out. I have type advantage against both of them. Uh, now I only need them to be higher level and then we're actually good because I'm pretty sure I cannot take them out in one hit. Even if I wanted to. See? Super Sun! And it hits. Don't is confused! Oh boy! That actually did it. If you only would have been faster, Muppet, that would have helped me a lot. I think you actually got more XP out of this. Oh boy! And paralyzed! There's no way Tony gets to attack again. There's no way Tony gets to attack ever again. So let's hope that's enough. Ay, 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 ay. It definitely is more EXP than Muppet gets. I definitely should look. I should look at the numbers. Ugh. But this ain't fun. Abnormality at detected. Yeah, sure. Sure. Ah. This is the one thing with Pokemon Colosseum, I think XD did it a little bit better because I don't remember that being such a hard specific part in XD. But the fact that you need to 
go around and train up the party like that. So let's go and fight all of them and maybe we try the very first Colosseum maybe. Maybe we try the very first Colosseum. That might actually be an idea here. So let's... Up is close to level up. Let's dig so that we can hit the whooper. Thundershock against Wingle should be enough. Water gun. Ugh. Stupid bird is fast. So much damage. I definitely need the levels. Let's just take it out. It's four times. It should do it. There we go. You also finally got your level up. Oh, it also does the dig. Nothing I do will hit now. So, Muppet. I don't wanna unnecessarily lose. Tony, so let's heal that. Nothing. Whooper use dig. Why did I know that it was gonna attack Tony? Like, why did I 100% know that? Let's just attack it straight up. Not very effective, but hopefully enough so that Thunder Shock can take it out. Oh boy, you already have the ground type. Why did I think Wooper has uh, only the water type? Let's just switch out to these two. Uh, I feel like I should have trained them up a lot more. I don't know why I didn't. Probably because the Pokemon that came up at this point were just dumb and just good for Squaggly. Like, that's 100% what I think is the problem there. Because Squaggly had such an easy time with everything else so far. Ah. Let's bite and Psybeam that thing and be done with it. Oh boy. The nuisance. The nuisance of training up your team. But if we wanna do progress, then that's what we gotta do. That's really not a lot of EXP that we get right now because of the XP share. <sighs> do I have maybe... Let's just have a quick look. Do I have some rare candies? I don't think I do, right? Just have the carbo stuff and everything. So iron for defense. Let's because I Albert, you get that. Protein and speed. Special defense. I'm gonna give that also to you. You're gonna be my defensive one. I'm gonna keep the protein and the carbos because I have a certain Pokemon in my day. I wanna give those two. But we don't have the Pokemon just yet. I don't know how long it will take until we have that. That's the other thing. But anyway, I'm gonna keep those. Also wanna point out, our inventory is tiny in this game. Like really tiny. Like we can hold so little stuff in total. It's kind of wild. Anyway, what's your spiel? Um. Black Pokemon can be extremely dangerous. Like take Scissor for example. Or... See that's what I mean with... Squaggly is just stupidly useful at this po point. Like everything that's ground type is stupidly useful at this point. Let's go Squaggly instead of so uh, Muppet. Because now electricity cannot hurt me. I can attack two of them at the same time. And I mean, yeah. Sure, they're gonna attack Tony. But I wanna have Tony up there. Especially Tony also has Dig, which is good. 
Shockwave. Let's match uh, you. Yeah, you charge yourself up there, Volt Orb. And hope with. Oh, wait, you're slower, probably. Yep, that stings. And the Volt Orb is faster, and I did not take out the Volt Orb, so I didn't. I did a bad! <laughs> That's what I wanna say. I should have done this the other way around. I really should take a look at the XP. So Tony, you go and heal yourself again. I think a normal... Wait, that's 20. No, we're gonna take a super. Just wanna make sure. And match out. Shockwave. Cheapers! Maybe it did not just take a potion. There you go, good job there. <gasps> We're getting closer. Yeah, it's really helpful to train up your Pokemon that way. That way they get, uh, I think, the double amount of the XP. I mean, no, I don't think it takes away from your second Pokemon in the party. If it does, then whoops. But whatever, that way I at least can train up one of my party member members faster. And that is definitely useful and needed. Like, really needed. So let's see, is there more up here? I think there were a few more up there. I hate that I have to go back and forth with healing so much, but my team's just not strong enough. I'm just going through this whole complex over and over, training my team up there is definitely a good idea. do do That's a good one. Ladian, those are both great Pokemon! So Tony only needs one more level for the evolution, which I'm aiming for because that's gonna make him so much stronger. Flame wheel, hopefully that does a good amount. Not enough though, not even nearly enough. It's gonna sting. Nope. No. Nope. Oh. That wasn't as bad. Comet punch is just a really bad move. Can you please stop attacking Tony? I'm counting on five. Oh wow. You know that's the dumb thing here with these moves. Because by themselves they're not strong but if you just get hit by them over and over of course they're gonna be strong. Swablu. I would love attack with Tony again but Tony will die because they really hate Tony is the thing because Tony's gonna get attacked again two times only this time it's good uh, wow Swablu is a little bit more of a damage sponge fury attack again Flame wheel. Please crit Tony. Ah. Ay, ay, ay. I hate this. At least only two hits. It should deal with that Swablu. Oh boy. 400. Yeah, that's a lot of EXP the there for Tony at once. Flame wheel, thunder, just take the thing out! I mean, the only good thing that comes from me having to train up my team now is the fact that I also get a lot of money out of that. So I can buy healing items. So it technically comes out good for me. But it's still annoying. 
it still is very much annoying. So let's heal Tony. I don't wanna run all the way back down. That should be enough, hopefully. I mean, Tony is so close to evolving, and then we would have a tough lotion. And that would definitely help wreck this place. Celio and Snowrunt. I hate Celio, Snowrunt is gonna take, be taken care of fast. But Celio is a blur. So I doubt that Muppet will have the strength that it needs to take that out. And if that no surf, then Tony's just dead. Oh, come on! So obnoxious. Come on! I see that you're trying to bother me up. I hate you still. Tony avoided that, which is good. And Muppet doesn't take a lot of damage from that. Be paralyzed. Not you, Muppet. Thank you. Flame wheel, thunder shock. We're good. Hey, we're good. That was the smoothest fight we had so far with these two. Ay, ay, ay. So obnoxious. That should give me a good amount of EXP because CLEO is a big job. How'd this happen? You know, I punched you over the head. That's how that happened. <sighs> we are getting close to evolving. <sighs> I am so done with this. This episode is just evolving. Galoo? And Seedra, you again giving me the perfect Pokemon for Tony and Muppet, which I like see. Now please just take them out in one swing, that would make this amazing surf. We're dead, Tony's dead. Whoa, Tony! Amazing, I'm impressed. I still think you're dead. Unless you kill it first. Nope. Why would we? That's honestly my question all the time. Why would we take something out first? Why? It's all so close! Ah! Sure, you're gonna get a crit for that. I am so incredibly done with all of you! Dirk, you got out there. Uh, use Psybeam dead. Uh, sure, I'm making money right now. I'm working on nothing else but making money right now and training up my Pokemon, so whatever. Dragon Dance, very good for you. I do not give a flying damn about that. Because you're gonna be taken care of next turn anyway. I just wanna have Tony back up because they still get to tickle down the... EXP for that. There we go. Sand slash. Actually good that we don't have Tony anymore. So we're gonna go for Psybeam on that. Thundershock the Seedra, which will flail at me first apparently. Muppet! And... I mean, I still need Muppet to be higher level. I cannot go and have Muppet not be higher level, because the paralyzation that I get with Muppet is just too good to pass up. Even though we have uh, Yawn with Squaggly. But it just takes some extra turns for that to happen. So close there, Psybeam. You can't do anything, so just call it! Muppet! Doesn't care. Maybe I should have just swatched, uh, sw switched it out so that it does not go down. 
Anywho, uh, Hilbert, you get that. Boy, boy, boy. Well, Dirk, you're gonna get a level up out of that, which is good. Nice, nice. Good. I love your special attack there, Dirk. And now we get the evolution as well. Dancing never won you any battles. Anyway. Tony! Let's go, Tony! Let's go, Tony! Evolve, get Well, that was interesting, recorded and Doggo just fell over the green screen in the background. I don't know why, but that just happened. Now we have a Typhlosion and a lifelong trauma. Anyway, I'm gonna end this episode here, I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna heal my party up. And next episode we're gonna... Um, I think there's only one trainer left in this building to take care of so we're gonna not do that I'm gonna go and figure out what we could do next maybe if there's a Colosseum that we can take care of where the trainer levels are not abysmally strong because I know that some Colosseums start with level 50 and that's something that we cannot deal with so anyway hope you enjoyed it see you next time bye